So I'm not gonna bullshit y'all. I'll let y'all know how my meals went. Told y'all I had enough to do four meals a day. So Monday through Friday, I had enough prep to do four meals a day. And uh, it is Saturday and I still have four entrees left. So, you know, I'm not gonna bullshit y'all. I act like I ate it all. Now, I will admit at work, I did have uh, some pizza and you know, I was eating, you know, different shit. I wasn't buying it, but you know, my job had pizza and stuff like that. So since I am bulking, I'm you know, it's okay. If I was cutting, I'd have to turn those pieces down. I'm gonna have to turn this shit down and continue to eat my meals. So But you know, there's no excuse. Uh, you know, I gotta do better. So this week I kinda know, you know, how I need to go about, you know, timing and eating my meals, but for now, I'm going to reward myself, and uh, you see I got the ground turkey cooking, and I'm going to make some Rotel. I got these chips on deck lined up. I went back to Walmart, and they were all gone, so who knows when they'll be back in store. So I'm glad I stocked up when I did. But, like I said, I'm going to have some Rotel tonight. You know, kind of reward myself, you know, for doing a pretty good job. And I got the butter pecan ice cream, you know, on deck. And so... You gotta reward yourself to keep yourself sane and to keep yourself motivated to continue to do this shit. I'm self-motivated already, but again, it never hurts to have something to look forward to such as the weekend. So, you know, Monday through Friday, you gotta get this shit done and then the weekend, you can kind of bullshit and, you know, eat, you know, your favorite food. So, that's what I'm doing. In the meantime, I am soaking these beans again because, you know, these beans are a long process, so I'll probably get started on those tomorrow. I'll let them soak for a while, about eight hours or so. And then tomorrow I'll get started back on that. And as far as the meats I'm going with for this week, um, instead of ground turkey, I got the uh, chicken breast. I'm going to switch it up, get the chicken breast. And I'm going to try to do a spicy chicken breast type recipe. Um, I'm going to cook it, try it out first. And if y'all want to know how it, is, how it turned out or want to know what it, how, what, how to do it, then just let me know and I'll let y'all, you know what I'm saying, keep y'all posted. But yeah, I just wanted to share that with y'all. Uh, let's turn the thing around. But yeah, that's it, man. Just wanted to share that with y'all. I really want to... Damn, what's this on my lens? I gotta clean that hoe. But I really want to take y'all to the gym with me when I do my next leg day. I know a lot of people have been asking questions about do I do legs and how do I do legs. I got a, I got a, uh, a nice way to approach legs that I don't know if... A lot of people approach legs the way I do, so I'm gonna try to, you know, get y'all in the gym with me when I do legs. Hopefully, I get somebody to record it because the the way I approach legs is the way I feel like everybody should approach legs. So be looking out for that, man. Especially if you want to get some superior results, man, and you know that's what it's all about over here. So yeah, be looking out for that. And uh, hold up, man. Let me show y'all the finished product of this shit. Let me zoom in real quick. Now, I know this is just Rotel, but damn it, who can prepare Rotel the way I just, damn it, look at this, man, like my auntie would say, your eyes may shine, your teeth may grit, but none of this superior DNA Rotel, you gonna get. <laughs> Yeah, uh, so, you know, I might leave it as that, man. This is just, this finna go down, man. It is finna go down. I just had to show y'all this finished product, man. Cap it off with this ice cream. I want to say, man, I had a hard time getting these meals down, man, but, uh, you know, it's rewarding once you do it. And I'm these aren't going to go to waste. I'm going to still eat these. Um, so I'll just prepare my meals this week, knowing that I got four meals to go, so... But yeah, guys, just wanted to share that with y'all, and uh, I'm about to enjoy it. All right, so fuck it, man. I'll go ahead and show y'all what's going on, man. So I got this chicken prepared. I bought two, two of these because I figured I might need it, but honestly, this gives me 12 pieces. So again, I still got this left, these four entrees, so I'm going to still match, try to kill that this week. But uh, 
Anyway, just preparing a, 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 a new recipe that I'm trying to, you know, try out. So we'll see how it goes. I'm not going to show y'all the full recipe now because, you know, I, I want to try it out after I, you know, it's finished and see how it is. But if y'all want to know, you know what I'm saying, after the finished product, then let me know and I make a how-to video, you know what I'm saying, on that. But, uh, you know, just got the, the stove going, man. You see, I already mashed on the uh, Rotel already. And, uh, you know what I'm saying, give my pot. I'll give y'all a little tip, man. Go ahead and put your oil as the base of the pan so it won't stick, even if it's a non-stick pan, man. But anyway, that's enough on that. I already dug in on this ice cream, as y'all can already tell. That's damn near halfway gone, so. When you're putting in work in the gym, you gotta feed the body, you know what I'm saying? You gotta treat the body, you know what I'm saying? So, that's how it is. But, uh, this is gonna be a short episode. Okay, so my timer is ready. So, as soon as I finish seasoning this up, which is just about done, I'm gonna throw it in the oven. And I will come back to show y'all what it's looking like, you know. I ain't going to have no taste test or nothing like that, but I will show y'all what it's looking like once I finish everything. So, uh, yeah, just stay tuned. All right, it is late as hell. Before I show y'all the product, let me show y'all what time it is. 1.43. Man, guys, I'm a cook, man. I'm, I'm going to have to show y'all this recipe because it's so tender. It is literally falling off the bone. I mean, off the, it ain't no bone. It's literally falling off the it's each other. It's falling off the the meat. is falling off the meat. Like it's crazy, man. Just look how nice this thing turned out. And unfortunately, I'm not gonna fool with it right now. It's real. It's still hot. So, but I'm definitely gonna have to share this with y'all, man. If y'all tired of this dry. Chicken, chicken breasts, you know, the shit you throw in the oven and just take out. This is an exclusive recipe. Now, I know what you're saying. It's got oil. It's got, it's got, I used, uh, let me show y'all what I used real quick. I used, uh, extra virgin olive oil. Um, and I know what you're saying. It for those who might be trying to track their macros or trying to cut on stuff like this. Well, here's the thing, okay? I used quite a bit of oil. Um, I just, you know, again, I greased the bottom and then put a little bit on the top. But I'm not going to be eating all that. That's that's just sitting in the pan. You need the oil just to, for cooking purposes, okay? You need the oil just so that it can turn out uh, moist, moisturized and, and not dry. Now, it's still going to have quite a bit of fat and juices on it, but that's okay. You know, that that's... You know, you're still going to have a lot of leftover fat, you know, that you can intake, you know, because this is not even going to be that much fat, you know what I'm saying? Unless you just put all this, the extra grease and shit in your, in your uh, tubware, you know, consume that, which I'm not. So, yeah, but, uh, anyways, I am bulking and, uh, this is going to be a great way for me to stay sane this is going to be a great way for me to enjoy my food because it's going to actually taste pretty good i can already tell and uh man listen if y'all want another recipe just let me know and i'll throw it out there for you but i ain't i can't give away too much right now but if y'all want another recipe let me know and, I, and i'll go ahead and give y'all you know everything that i did from step to step although it's pretty much self-explanatory what i did um, but I'll give y'all, you know, details as far as how much time I left it in there for and just, you know, what I did. So, yeah, you guys, this this is this episode is pretty much showing you, you know, me prepping my food again. You know, again, I had this Rotel, which is still sitting here, man. I couldn't finish all of it. I'll probably finish it tomorrow. Today is still Saturday, by the way. And, uh, yeah, let me go ahead and flip the camera so y'all can see me real quick. Yeah, but today is still Saturday. As y'all can see my hair, you know what I'm saying? I'm doing a little experimentation. But, uh, yeah, man, so... Again, I'll probably be changing it up as far as what type of meat I'm using per week with my meal prepping. Last time y'all saw me, I had ground turkey. This time it's gonna be... It's, it's, uh... 
chicken breast. I might fuck me honestly, dog. Honestly, I might fuck with this chicken breast recipe for real, man. Cause again, I used to cook. The, I used to do the same thing. Like my chicken breast used to turn out dry, and it's like I can't even fucking eat this shit. It's like God. It's like damn. But this is some exclusive ass shit. I think I came across something exclusive right here. So this is gonna be a good way for y'all to enjoy y'all's uh y'all's y'all's chicken breast, and you know. This might be some go-to shit for a lot of y'all, man. So let me know, and I will share it with y'all um, in another cooking video, a separate cooking video, step by step, everything I did, and definitely let y'all know what's going on. So, all right, I'm just looking at this, man. This is gonna be. Look, I'm gonna give y'all one more look, man. I give y'all one more good look. I know, man. It is gonna go down. But uh, tomorrow I'll be prepping my rice, and as you see, I got the beans soaked still. I added more water because they had already, uh, they had already, uh, what you call it? It soaked up most of it, so I had to, you know, add more water to it. So, but tomorrow I'll cook my rice, which don't take that much time. Then my sweet potatoes, which takes quite a bit of time. A sweet potatoes is probably the longest time to cook because. If you want them soft and caramelized, it's gonna take you about, and it's, it, depending on how many you put in there at a time, so it's gonna take a while for me to cook those. So um, that's probably the longest thing. Probably should did those first, but anyway. But guys, stay tuned because, like I said, be looking out for a, a leg video, really showing you how to how I approach legs, and really the way I approach legs is how I approach a, all my workouts. I realized once I started approaching my workout and training this type of way, you know, results came. I just started feeling a lot superior. You know, I started feeling a lot superior as far as just me in the gym, my physique, attitude. And I really felt like I was on some Fujita, you know, freezer type shit. Like I really, like I'm serious. Like I, I that you know, that, but that's the way I approach these workouts. And I'll show y'all, you know, hopefully if I can get a camera person soon but and if not i'll set up you know i got some cold ass set up i can set the whole up so y'all can see it but i'm doing too much talking right now i'm about to take my ass to bed i'm up here listening to this podcast uh alan roger curry mole one i don't know how many of y'all be on that but for a lot of the guys out there who um y'all might y'all might you know as far as dating and as far as how to get on these females I be seeing the, some of the message. I be asking where the hoes at, man. Listen, the hoes are everywhere. The hoes ain't going nowhere. You know what I'm saying? My my question to you is, do you know how to get on them? You know what I'm saying? But yeah, that's the OG man, Alan Roger Curry. Uh, check him out, man. Good ass podcast. But in the meantime, I'm tired. About to lay it down. And uh, tomorrow, get everything else prepped. Y'all just stay tuned for some more shit to come. All right. Yeah!